Pretentious dino nuggies or I'll perish. Well, I don't want you to perish, so. So my fiance and I were discussing the menu at our upcoming toddler-focused gastropub. The topic came up of dino nuggies. How can we make it more than the box of breading and preservatives that it currently is? Turn it into an homage to the prehistoric period which has come to define all of us in ways that we just could not imagine. Today we bring you our take on the simple dino nuggy. Elevated, playful, and dare I say it, an absolute game changer for dino nuggies everywhere. Without further ado, we bring to you our beautiful take on the humble dino nuggy. Sorry, my chinois in the shop. We have actually partnered with our friends at the Prehistoric Meat Cooperative. This is actually an iguanodon, not quite as fatty as their woolly mammoth, but not quite as lean as their triceratop. They use the DNA sequences of a chicken and a Komodo dragon to not be compared to a simple chicken thigh. Ancient breadcrumbs. The sourdough starter to make this was actually encased in amber, so it's actually millions of years old. House cured salt. Rice milled black pepper. Four times smoked paprika. Most people think it's paprika. It's actually paprika. Spices were ground in this, which is definitely a molcajete. You can buy one of these actually at www.definitelyamolcajete.org into our blast chiller. A guanadon skin. We don't want to waste this prehistoric treasure. Paprika, house milked truffle oil, house made parchment to roast this. So while our iguanodon hardens up, let's set up our breading station. Rice milled durum wheat. I did that this morning. Prehistoric breadcrumbs. I'm going to be drop methoding our eggs for an egg wash. We elected to forego our super sweet eggs in exchange for these more gamey, delicious iguanodon hatchlings. Hand plucked thyme, conflict free parsley. Parsley is actually the most violence prone here. Classic Tyrannosaurus Rex shape. I welded these molds out of old cutlery. Nicely floured. Iguanodon egg wash, our beautiful breadcrumbs. Fried in iguanodon fat. So you have iguanodon three ways. Our stegosaurus, just get a little bit more color on him. Puree of potato. This represents the earth, like the Robichon potato, but with about 60% more fat. Crater, this is about where the asteroids would have struck. Our fallen friends, kind of a mess just as the world would have been. Potatoes two ways, not just the soil, also the rock. With our plating tweezers, we are going to add beautiful iguanodon flakes to represent the viscera, sauteed fungi stems, tree trunks, fallen flora, conflict-free parsley. A further reminder of the viscera and violence that took place, splashes of ketchup clean up around the rim here. <laughs> and there you have it, our take on Dino Nuggets, titled The Tragedy of the Jurassic Period. Perfect for your small children. That will be $650. Your children can use any combination of your credit cards.